Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peep game. All right, man. Will Triple G finally take on a real fight, or will he continue to fight truck drivers and you know uh, gas station attendants and basically uh, mailmen? You know the IBF has ordered a match between him and Sergey Derby and Tinko, and Triple G has the chance to quiet his naysayers at least for now. Still has a horrible resume even after this fight. If he takes the fight and wins the fight, he still doesn't have a great resume. But this is his chance to at least keep people quiet for the time being. You know, at the end of the day, you know, Triple G has gotten away for years for basically not stepping up in competition and just basically fighting, you know, um, just, just, just bums, just, just trash. And then getting all the credit in the world and getting made a top 10 pound for pound fighter. But then, like I said before, these are the same people that despise Deontay Wilder and accuses him of fight bums. But we all know what's up with that. But I think this is a good fight for Triple G. You know, um, this is a chance for him to have a solid fight. You know, whether he can win this fight, which I would pick him to beat Derby and Janko. I don't think he would stop him, but I think he probably would beat him. But at the same time, he needs to take on this fight. Because like I said, Triple G is basing his whole career off whether he lands a rematch with Canelo. And I just don't think that's cool. Your whole career should be based off you know, three big paydays with Canelo, and Canelo is sort of like made it clear he don't want to fight you. So, you've also had the chance to fight Demetrius Andrade, rematch with Daniel Jacobs, Jamal Chalo, and you've basically been like, uh-uh. So, we'll see what's up with Triple G, man. Anyway, this your boy, Tail Biz. I am out.